I do not promote drinking at all. In any of my videos, just to give everyone a heads up, please drink responsibly and please drink at your age that you're allowed to drink at whatever country you're from. MLG4 here. Welcome back to another wonderful weekend. The show where we get to enjoy cloudless skies and of course interruptions. But that's enough. That's normal. So what's happening this weekend? Well, today specifically, there's nothing happening too much. But this weekend, I'm going to be a huge white boy. And by that, I mean I'm going to be going on a wine tour. Well, a partial wine tour. It's going to be our self-guided wine tour. We're going up into the Cayuga Lake, I believe, or we're gonna do the Seneca Lake. You'll see tomorrow which one we're doing, but we are gonna be doing a wine tour, which is actually world renowned because they are the Finger Lakes wine tours up in New York, which are very special. And it's something that I've been wanting to do for a long time. But anyways, what else is happening this weekend? Well, it's Labor Day weekend, but I have school Monday, so it doesn't really help that I can't do too, too much. But we're gonna find something to do, very special things to do. Something like that. <laughs> so let's just start this wonderful weekend. <gasps> kitty, 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 kitty. Well, it looks like I'm going to bed. I got nothing really to talk about other than if you want to hear a delivery story, but I guess I gotta wrap up my minutes, so I better tell about that delivery story. So what happened was we did, took, we had, we broke our record for how f our farthest delivery, which we delivered to a town, oh, which we delivered to Franklin Deck, which is from our restaurant. It's about 15 if not 20 minutes away so it was a good drive a very good drive i'm gonna go to bed now because i'm tired and that was a story yeah that was a story i there's nothing really else i could talk about that night other than i mean other that delivery other than the fact that i had a co-worker go with me so i won't get lost and panic and lose my mind and everything because we didn't have the right number and we didn't even have we weren't sure of the right address because it couldn't go into our GPSs or anything. So it was a very fun time to deal with all that. Yeah, that's the story. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for the fun in the Cayuga Lake area, which I don't think I've recorded anywhere for a wonderful weekend there. And sadly, that's one, one of the cities I want to record there, which I probably will be able to actually record there this weekend. So let the weekend continue and I'll see you guys there. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Hello. It's time for us to go, 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 go. Wine tour time. We're doing, we're doing the most white thing we could do. <laughs> time on my phone today, though. We're gonna forget about ethic, ethnicity, and we're just gonna head out. All right. Here's our first stop of our self-guided wine tour, and we're stopping at Six Mile Creek Vineyard. I should also. Hi. I should also mention that this is going to be a new place for a wonderful weekend, either Ithaca or a surrounding town of Ithaca. So hello, new place, welcome to Wonderful Weekend. And I'm going to be introducing it to a few other places at Wonderful Weekend this weekend. So hello, new places, and welcome to Wonderful Weekend. I just want to make an intro right now instead of saying hello each and every time. So let's just have fun. I just want to have fun today. I think this is going to be a great day to have fun. Beautiful weather, beautiful skies. Barely any wind. It's seriously going to be a wonderful day. It's, we're going to have fun. We're going to have so much fun. We kind of ran into our first problem. We forgot to make reservations. Oops. Hopefully we can find somewhere we can pop in and sit and have fun. If not, oops. Too. We're gonna retry this again. I don't think this place needs reservations. Reservations had to be like 15 plus, so hopefully we'll get some room in here. Well, at least we got our wines this time. So we're gonna, I'm gonna be taste testing. Just a reminder, I do not promote drinking at all. In any of my videos, just to give everyone a heads up, please drink responsibly and please drink at your age that you're allowed to drink at whatever country you're from. Here is our next stop. So we're gonna try some more wine. Now I should mention that this is the winery that we're at right now. That's the very first winery in the Cayuga Lake Wine Trail. This is actually gonna be a nice experience. Really excited. And well, I'm gonna give a rating of the last one. I am not an official wine 
taster. I'm I'm not even certified no, for it. Certified. It's only my opinion, and my opinion solely. I if you guys if any of you guys are wine actual wine taste testers, you can mock me for all you want. The only one that was good at the last one was Red Velvet, Red uh, Barn Barn Raisin Red. Yeah, Barn, barn Raisin Red. Barn, uh, barn, raisin. barn Raisin Red, yeah, that's what it was called. <laughs> We're gonna taste us here. Also, we got free glasses. Okay, this, this is the brand new flavor that they just released today here. How is that Mitchell Magic? I give it a three. Out of 10? Yeah. Here, here goes mine. It's not. Bad. It might give it a six out of ten. It's not it the worst. Sweet? It's not that sweet, but you can taste the bitterness. But it's not like a bitter that it's like it's just overpowering everything. So that's a good thing. We're gonna be stumbling our way to our last winery, which got a 2017 award for the state. So we're gonna try it. Well, I can finally give my final review for all the places that we went to. The more north we went, the better it was. Let's just put it that way. So, the last one we went to, forget the name of it, here's the name of it, that was excellent. That was really, that was good too, but wasn't as good as the winery that we just went to. And I'll, just, I'll re-show the name again. It is Buttonwood Grove. That was an excellent, excellent overall. I, I enjoyed Buttonwood out of the three places that we went to today. Actually, I found my favorite wine today from here. It's the Blackwood Briar. I think that's what it's called. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Really liked it. We're gonna head home now. We have a shop around, so we're safe. We're gonna be okay, if anyone's wondering. And we'll see you guys back home, where we'll see what happens. And we'll, we'll have fun. We'll always have fun. Okay, well, that was today. I had a fun day today, and it was not bad at all. Hi, me. Forgot I had that there behind me. You guys get to enjoy my beautiful, very dark face. Man, I got so tan. I, I can get that tan. I can get so tan. I can get so tan. Anyways, I'm gonna be heading to bed. I, I had a fun day today. After, I mean, afterwards, what I did was we, I had a party and then now I've been just chilling out in my room and down here and playing and I got addicted to Fall Guys now. Why did I decide to rope myself in Fall Guys? I'm going to get addicted to it. But, I hate myself for buying Fall Guys, but oh well. It wasn't that bad. It isn't that bad. Uh, anyways, it's time for me to head to bed. And it's time for me to continue on and finish up this weekend. So I'll see you guys tomorrow to wrap up whatever's happening this weekend. Good afternoon, everyone. Hello. We're here having Chinese, because I haven't had Chinese in a little bit, actually. Oh, I just wanted to have some fun. Just wanted to get out of the house and have some more enjoyment, I guess. Today's chore is painting, yet again. Well, it's not that big of a deal, but this is now my fourth painting job. And I'm painting this and the other side of the shed, so. Well, it's time to scrape away. Scrape my problems away. I need to scrape my problems away. I have too many problems. Well, it looks like that's what it's gonna do for me for this weekend. So I'm gonna just chill here, play Fall Guys, and have fun. Thank you guys for watching this wonderful weekend, and I'll see you guys in the next video. But hey, you know it's funny. Live life.